A blessed day learners. I'm teacher Lumaban. Let's take a review on biological science, said 6A. Be ready and prepare yourself as we embark. Learn and enjoy this video. Be safe, and God bless you always. Commit your way to the Lord, trust also in Him, and He shall bring it to pass. Psalm 37 verse 5 which are small, irregularly shaped cells without nuclei but are rich in ADP. Letter A leukocytes. Letter B erythrocytes. Letter C lymphocytes. Letter D thrombocytes. Choose the suitable answer based on the given choices in 5 seconds. 5 4 3 2 1 the correct answer is letter B erythrocytes. The erythrocytes are small, irregularly shaped cells without nuclei but are rich in ADP. What branch of biology is involved when one is studying the characteristic structure and functions of all kinds of cells? Letter A cytology. Letter B histology. Letter C Physiology Letter D Morphology Choose the suitable answer based on the given choices in 5 seconds. 5 4 3 2 1 The correct answer is letter A Cytology. Cytology is a branch of biology involved when one is studying the characteristic structure and functions of all kinds of cells. Which part of the seed appears as a scar which marks the entry of the pollen tube during fertilization? Letter A testa. Letter B hilum. Letter C seed leaf. Letter D cotyledon. Choose the suitable answer based on the given choices in 5 seconds. 5 4 3 2 1 The correct answer is letter B hilum. The hilum is part of the seed that appears as a scar that marks the entry of the pollen tube during fertilization. Which type of tissue is responsible for the secondary growth in stems and roots of vascular plants? Letter A Cambium Letter B Epidermis Letter C Palisade Layer Letter D Meristematic Cells Choose the suitable answer based on the given choices in 5 seconds. 5 4 3 2 1 The correct answer is letter A cambium. The cambium is a type of tissue responsible for the secondary growth in stems and roots of vascular plants. Which biome grows tropical grassland with scattered individual trees and larger herbivores? Letter A Tundra Letter B Savanna Letter C Grassland Letter D Rainforest Choose the suitable answer based on the given choices in 5 seconds. 5 4 3 2 1 The correct answer is Letter B Savanna the savanna biome grows tropical grassland with scattered individual trees and larger herbivores. What do you call that process in birds wherein they shed off features at least once a year? Letter A molting. Letter B skinning. Letter C migrating. Letter D furrowing. Choose the suitable answer based on the given choices in 5 seconds. 5 4 3 2 1 The correct answer is letter A molting. Molting is the process in birds wherein they shed off features at least once a year. What chemical controls metamorphosis among insects? 
Letter A Enzymes Letter B Estradiol Letter C Ethylene Letter D Pheromones Choose the suitable answer based on the given choices in 5 seconds. 5 4 3 2 1 The correct answer is letter A Enzymes. The enzyme is a chemical that controls metamorphosis among insects. Which of the following makes up the plant cell wall? Letter A lipids Letter B protein Letter C cellulose Letter D nucleic acid Choose the suitable answer based on the given choices in 5 seconds. 5 4 3 2 1 The correct answer is letter C cellulose. Cellulose makes up the plant cell wall. Which of the following is not true of fungi? Letter A. Some are edible. Letter B. Some are pathogenic. Letter C. Some are photosynthetic. Letter D. Form symbiotic relations with algae. Choose the suitable answer based on the given choices in 5 seconds. 5 4 3 2 1 The correct answer is letter C. Some are photosynthetic. Some are photosynthetic is not true of fungi. Which of the following is not true of plants? Letter A. Some are edible. Letter B. Some are pathogenic. Letter C. Some are photosynthetic. Letter D. Form symbiotic relations with algae. Choose the suitable answer based on the given choices in 5 seconds. 5 4 3 2 1 the correct answer is letter D form symbiotic relations with algae. The form of symbiotic relationship with algae is not true of plants. Which of the following is considered multicellular? Letter A egg cell. Letter B embryo. Letter C sperm cell. Letter D fertilized egg. Choose the suitable answer based on the given choices in 5 seconds. 5 4 3 2 1 The correct answer is letter B embryo. The embryo is considered multicellular. What hormone promotes the growth of the uterine lining for the implantation of the embryo? Letter A oxytocin. Letter B testosterone. Letter C progesterone. Letter D lactogenic hormone. Choose the suitable answer based on the given choices in 5 seconds. 5 4 3 2 1. The correct answer is letter C progesterone. The progesterone hormone promotes the growth of the uterine lining for the implantation of the embryo. I hope you enjoyed. Learn something new about our topic on biological science. Set 5A. If you learn something in this video, please give this video a thumbs up. Don't forget to share this video with your friends. If you have comments, questions, and suggestions, you can leave a message in the comment section below. Thank you very much for watching my videos. Hoping that we meet again in my next video. And God bless you always. It is Teacher Luma Ben YouTube channel.